I'd like to share my new Housewise Altair tabletop fire pit with you. I'm excited for this one because I really like the look of it and it's a little different than the one I already have. This one is concrete as well, but it's a very beautiful, uh, very uh, polished looking concrete. It's I like the black on it as well. And it has a base made of the same material and they give you a pad, a felt pad to make it so that the base does not scratch up the tabletop you're putting it on. Now this is important because it's going to keep the heat away from whatever surface you're putting it on. This has a lip on it. You can see right there and the bottom of the pit itself has a little ledge here. So that fits in there really nice. And you know that it's, it's going to stay on there uh, and be lined up. Now the way this works is you go ahead and put this larger stainless steel bowl in there. And then it comes with some ceramic wool, which you just put in the bottom of that. And then the fuel it uses, you can use rubbing alcohol, which is also called isopropyl alcohol, uh, which you can buy in any drugstore, a grocery store, you, anywhere around you can find rubbing alcohol, probably in, in your medicine cabinet or underneath your bathroom sink. Uh, or you can use a bioethanol. They also um, do have that available. You can buy that in a lot of different places as well. I have already uh, added some rubbing alcohol to this and you just set that in there like that. Uh, it, at this point, all you're going to do to get this lit is either get a lighter, a long lighter, or you're going to get a long match. And then you just go ahead and light it. And you can barely tell that that's lit. And it says it will take up to 10 minutes to get the flame to where you would, you know, the optimal appearing flame. But as you can see, it is going and it is already starting to give a little, um, little more color and a little more height on it. Now, what I like about this is you, you can use it in so many different places on so many different occasions. Uh, you can use it on your back patio uh, as just a place to do s'mores. You could um, put it in the middle of your dining room table just for the ambiance with it, next to your hot tub. Just any surface that is a stable level surface um, works just great with it. Uh, they do, it also does include these two little forks, which is nice to be able to um, roast marshmallows over it. I really love the appearance of this. I, I'm really excited about this one. And uh, when you are ready to put it away, it also comes with this extinguisher, which basically snuffs out the flame. It takes away all the uh, all of the oxygen from the air the area in there that feeds the flame, and that um, snuffs the flame completely out and it's, it's out now. So then you just let it cool off in the center. The outside here is not hot at all. Um, the outside bowl in there might be a little warm, but the one in the middle will be warm. So you don't want to reach in and touch that. Uh, it is something to um, basically keep an eye on your children around it because it's a flame and that's just a common sense thing, but I'll just go ahead and put that out there. And I just think it's a really perfect accessory to your uh, entertaining friends and family.